Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Arm Wrestling Simulator, where today I'm going to be doing something that might just get me in trouble with the game's developers, but honestly, I don't think it's my fault, and if you're wondering what the heck I'm talking about, well, let me explain. Now, a few days ago, I went ahead and grinded out this new weekly leaderboard feature that is an Arm Wrestling Simulator. It is open and accessible for everyone to play it. As you can see, top 100 players get exclusive awards, but what are the leaderboards that are able to be grinded? You can grind weekly wins, which is actually the one that I managed to grind grind and actually get number one on last week there's also weekly strength and weekly bosses weekly bosses is probably the best free to play thing to do as you can see it's pretty competitive and you can really defeat any boss in the game strength is a little pay to win because you basically have to have access to the very end world but as you guys saw i opened a ton of lucky blocks and was able to be successful and actually get number one in the entire game and if you're wondering what do you actually get for being number one in the entire world for weekly wins well if you head over here to these weekly rewards you could see the very simple rewards for the different tiers. So top 100 gets, I don't even know the name of this pet. I don't know the multiplier of this pet, but it's a 1% chance and a best for a nine. Top 50 get, I'm guessing a slightly better version, probably around 80 million multiplier of the 2.5% chance of best for nine. But top three, which unfortunately there's no special reward for getting number one in the world, but top three still 25% chance at a best for nine. And this pet has a 120 million multiplier, which is to my knowledge, the highest multiplier of any free to play pet in the entire game. So originally I think these pets are supposed to be given out on Thursday or Friday, but there was an issue distributed them to all the accounts. And so today on Saturday, when I got on for the updates, I made sure to check and see, did I actually get my pet? And as you can see right here, we have an elite cobalt. That's the name of the pet, 120 million multiplier, best for eight. But I kept on scrolling and I went, wait, I have a second one. Wait, I have a third and a fourth and a fifth. And if we look up elite cobalt, I have, as you can see, we're not going to delete them. Got to be very careful later, but if we if we click select all, we have 49 elite cobalt best friend eight pets with 120 million multiplier. Now I went ahead. The first thing I did was realize, yo, so, <laughs> this isn't supposed to be like this. Cause obviously you're, you're not getting 50. No words to say 50 on any of these are 49. You're supposed to get one. And I, I got 49. So I hit up the developers and they're like, oh, well that's an issue. And they said that they are going to be, I think heavily nerfing the actual multiplier of this pet or basically making it so these pets can no longer be obtained. They're, they're going to be pretty much outlawing these pets, but I asked if I would still be able to use it because it's pretty cool. I worked my butt off to get to, to number one for wins in the weekly leaderboard, and they made a goof, and well, they said, you know what? You could take advantage of it. You can go ahead and max out this pet. You earned it. But moving forward, this will not happen. At least at this extent, they might keep using this pet. They might change the multiplier, but all I know is this happened to a few other accounts. As you see, there's 66 that exist when there should only be like nine or 10 that exist, and there's a good chance I wouldn't add actually combine all of them up to turn it into my new best pet as I'll be doing in today's video if I manage to get any best for nine pets because best for nine that enchant has been on the game for I think like two or three weeks now and just doing a quick run over as you can see we literally don't have a single oh wait we have one oh that's my first one I was about to combine it oh my gosh this is my first best for nine ever in the whole game 200% multiplier that is insane oh my gosh I almost combined it I almost turned it gold and, and combined it. Uh, I thought I'd look through all them, but there we go. We have looked through all them and they are just one best friend nine, which is absurd. So that's what it looks like. It's a 200% increase over your best pet, which will also be the elite cobalt. But because this pet, there's a chance it might not exist in a few days or maybe even a few hours. We're going to go ahead and turn this banned and illegal elite cobalt pet in our missing simulator to my new best pet. And if we have any leftover, I'm actually going to be giving these leftovers to you all through the new mailbox gifting system. And if you want a chance to get one of these pets, all you have to do is comment your Roblox name down below and make sure you guys have subscribed to the channel. And then you'll have a chance of receiving one of these pets. I think we should have like two or three extra, or at least that's what I'm hoping for. So the first thing you do, as always, when you want to max out a pet in Arm Wrestling Simulator is head to the gold machine in World 2. And what we want to do is turn all these into golden pets. And because I don't want to take any chances, we're going to go ahead and craft five at a time. And let's just make sure that our best friend 
nine pet isn't is it somehow already been used I, I locked it just making sure okay yeah i did lock it that is good to know would have been a sad day if we already got rid of our one and only best friend nine but we basically have to craft nine of these golden pets and that's because it takes nine regular pets or nine baby pets in order to make one huge and so again i think if i did my math right 49 and we're locking one so we have 48 of these and we only need 45 to craft it then i i think we should be good i'm like 99 sure we should be good i'm also just double checking to make sure that no best friend nines are somehow slipping by because that would that would also be incredibly incredibly tragic all right so we have that six seven see so yeah, i just need two more it should be good to go and this is the last one so yeah we have three of these left over and i'll be gifting three of these to again some random commenters down below in the comment section but now it is time to really kick things off because this pet already has a 180 million multiplier but oh, we aren't even close to being done so let's go ahead and craft this one into a big and then craft this one into big and then our final big one the big ones currently have a 270 million multiplier that's absolutely insane so the last thing to do craft it up into a huge and we now have a golden huge elite cobalt now we should be able to increase this pet strength by another like 10x or so i think this should be around a 4 billion multiplier pet by the time we are done with this so the next thing to do head over to the goliath machine all you have to do in order to turn a pet into a goliath which gives it an extra 50 percent boost is just having it already be a huge pet in the first place uh, we're gonna go ahead and spend a little bit of robux to skip the timer so let's go see now elites this has a 452 million <laughs> multiplier and if you're wondering what am i gonna do with this well world 10 is actually coming out next week at arm wrestling simulator so we're gonna need the biggest best baddest pet in the entire game in order to get enough strength to beat those bosses when that world does come out so we will be replacing our 2.8 billion shadow hound pet that we've been using over the last few weeks and we're also going to be doing some tests to see how strong is my team at the very end of this because there's a chance we might have the one of the world's strongest teams in all of arm wrestling simulator but the next step over in this process is to head to the beach world because that is of course where the void machine is located and for me i do have a game pass that basically makes it so this time is zero but normally it takes five hours to go from golden to void and that is the natural progression of pets in the game but as you can see like a five second timer because you do have the void game pass and oh that is nice a nice little even 600 million multiplier oh and let's actually see what this looks like as well we have some pets equipped show our pets turn on i normally don't play with it because it just looks kind of wonky having all the exact same pet turn on but let us i guess equip this unequip all and then go see what this thing is looking yeah dang that is so huge you can just barely see me at the bottom this is too wicked now, i want to show it now because the next step if you guys are familiar with the process of maxing out pets in arm wrestling simulator well we have to go to the bunker because that is where our next evolution is oh wait i just realized do we even have enough pet xp to max this thing out at least on this account we are definitely pretty far away and i might have to see if i can't go buy some uh, some pet xp or something but with 317 apples now this is one of the ways to increase a pet strength so it went from yeah level zero to level 33 and it just got a 100 million strength boost from 600 million to 700 million so we're gonna max this out do not fear do not worry but again i just wanted to show this pet in this crazy state before we ended up dude i literally can't even have this turn on i i can't i have to like run in for even in first person mode i can't see anything all right turn the pets off unfortunately because next thing we have to do oh my gosh how many pets are in here jeez i have like 300 of these dominuses and ultimately i have to god dude i have to keep them because they're best friend eight like i have to trade them to my alt account but i'm obviously busy and in the middle of something so we're gonna lock these up to make this process just a little bit easier all right well it seems like locking these pets did absolutely nothing but ran world 4 because this mutate machine has a one percent chance of giving our pets the ghost mutate and if you're wondering what does that do well it basically doubles the strength of your pets without you having to do literally anything so unfortunately we managed to get a glowing and that's only i think like a 35 percent increase so we have a thousand of these health kits which should be way more than enough because usually it's not too brutal maybe it takes me 30 or so tries to get ghosts sometimes i've had to do this over 80 times in a row but we basically go back and forth and back and forth it's a pretty easy process it's just very time consuming and if you don't have these health kits well then you're just kind of out of luck and you, you can't do it at all so this is nothing compared to our next step after this and in one of our actual final steps so i'm just gonna chill here enjoy the time while i can because the next one is so not fun and i'll let you guys know when we get a ghost Oh, that was so close. Come on. That's like the closest we've been so far. Six 
hours later. Oh my dude. Oh, what? How is that even possible? We're like 40 in and it's uh it's not going too great as you can see. Oh, there we go. I, I had to do a little double take, but we finally, it took, it took, it only took around 10 minutes. So I don't know why I'm saying finally, but it, it took us on 50 spins, which is a little bit more than usual, but we have ourselves a ghost version, ghost mutate of this cobalt. So now it is a elite cobalt and we hover over, you can see it's void and ghost. And it's already sitting at a 1.4 billion multiplier. Pretty, pretty good. If you ask me now, there is one final thing besides leveling it up with the pet XP, which I have a fear might be a, a, a little little worrisome because I, I didn't account for that and <laughs> I need to go get an absolute ton of pet XP. What, 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 that's, a, that's another problem for later on in the video. Not a problem for me right now because we have to worry about something even more difficult than just finding pet XP out there to be traded with. We have to get super lucky in this World 7 Slimeify machine, which as you guys know, bro, this is my, this is everyone's arch nemesis because to get the best slime, the red slime, it gives a 2.25x multiplier. So this would immediately be like a 3 billion multiplier pet with a 2.25x on it but there's only a 1.75 percent chance in, in getting that and basically it's one in 50 and i might be thinking hey that's not that bad the last machine wasn't that bad but let's go ahead and just roll this elite cobalt see what we get i already know it's gonna be some garbage uh, yellow literally the worst possible slime now we can go ahead and go back to the bunker because that's how you de-slime it and basically repeat this process but uh, you're gonna see something that i don't like oh let's not cure it that would have been really bad let's de-slime it it takes one minute or or we could skip it for 15 Robux. And because this process normally takes 30, 40, or 50 tries, I'm not gonna wait here for over an hour to do that. So we're gonna have to spend quite a lot of Robux in order to do this. So it's a super repetitive process and it's it just not really well optimized because you gotta go back to world seven, run all the way over here. And then you can finally deposit your pet in the machine. And I just assume I don't actually get it. So I instantly teleport back to the bunker, which we will go to the cure machine, hit D slime. And this is where we see what we have which as you can see we have another yellow so it just it's a sucky process but it's a part of the grind you got to do it you got to repeat it until we actually get the glorious red slime so just gonna time lapse this one because there's not gonna be anything actually fun about it well i hope you guys enjoyed that little time lapse session because we ended up not not getting it uh i, I think we've done around 30 or 35 slimes and well as you see we're currently sitting with absolutely nothing but remember how i mentioned that we needed some additional pet xp well i ended up finding someone willing to trade some tokens for pet xp which is perfect because i do not mind but we actually have enough i think they wanted 400 tokens for 1250 of the blue apples if you don't know these blue apples are like the best in the game and just to show you guys our pet currently is level 33 and if we go ahead and go over and apply the rest of our blue apples we should probably be close to like 70 yeah 62 okay it's not 70 but 62 those apples are by far the most powerful as you can see we're already at a 1.572 billion boost and then we have a little bit of other pet xp actually we don't have much oh we have some godly bones we can very much so chuck these on so with the pet xp that i already had we were able to get our pet up to level 78 which honestly is most of the way there but listen we're going for a fully max pet and it wouldn't be fully max if we weren't able to get to level 99 so let's go ahead and trade over our tokens being a bit nice because i feel like this deal is pretty good 500 tokens are basically 500 robux for enough pet xp to max everything out feels reasonable to me and oh 15 bro he's chucking in more he, he doesn't have to do that by any means but 1500 perfect apples i kind of wanted to just give him some more tokens and not have him take all the apples but hey it, it works with me fine by me we now have enough pet xp to fully max out our elite pet and uh very very helpful because i would have taken many hours of hard work and apparently he's got something for me don't know what we're in for if we're in for a treat or in for uh what, what oh wait they have, there's a chat feature now is that new oh Oh, interesting. I didn't realize that was there. Hey, you learn something every day in Arm Wrestling Simulator. <laughs> Five lucky blocks. Let's go. Big shout out, Mr. Weapon Fighting Sim Lover. <laughs> what a name. All right, now we can head off to the garden because that is mainly where you obtained all the pet XP in the first place. So we can go ahead and carefully apply this pet XP because we're not going to need all of it. Uh, let's go ahead and apply... Mm, 
through, let's say 400 for now and see how close that gets us to our goal of level 99. Level 94, as you can see, it costs 10,000 XP per level. It's super expensive and it's just not worth it. If you guys are ever worrying about leveling up your pets, probably just get to like level 70, level 80 because maxing it out, I think it takes a, a pretty much around as much pet XP from level 80 to level 100 as it does from level 1 to level 80. So you just have to dump in a ton of resources into these last levels and whoa, not all of them, just 150. Starting to go kind of slow now. So let's see, what is this? 97. Ooh, so close. Probably like 50 more and we'll be there. So we'll have actually a lot of apples left over, which is perfect because when World 10 comes out, we're going to be needing some more pet XP big time. So level 99 has been achieved. 1.8 billion multiplier pet and literally the last thing, all that's left to do is get it red slime. All that's left to do. I've been working my butt off so far and uh, spent quite a few Robux actually as well and still nothing. So we slime it, we roll it, we go back to the bunker and we hope once and for all we can get a red slime and then chuck it into our team to see, hey, is this thing actually any good? And was it worth grinding for? Oh, holy crap. I can't believe it. We've done it, folks. We have the red slime pet. Okay. And, and I want to see, I think that was around 40 or 45 slimes. It, it was a lie. That was by far the most strenuous part of this. It took 40 minutes of sliming while paying to skip. So imagine sitting there for a minute every time you want to eat slime and not paying Robux. Yeah, this could easily take an hour and a half to maybe even three hours if you're unlucky. But for the grand reveal, I don't even know myself what the final number is going to be. Four billion. Exactly. Let's go. So that is a 25% strength increase over our previous best pet, the Shadow Hound. Actually, a bit more because I had 2.85 billion and ours has a little over 4 billion. So now all that's left to do is go ahead and put on our strength team. And then, of course, first, let's lock this pet. We don't want to be losing it. Same thing with these other ones. Go ahead and lock them. And then we can equip it. And now our team, let's do a little bit of math. So this pet is, let's get super accurate here, okay? It's 4 billion, 36 million, and we have 44 best friend eight. So I guess we can chuck it. Well, let's not worry about the best friend nine. That is 177 billion total stats. We'll go ahead and add on the 4 billion, 36 million, and we have 181 billion total stat team. But folks, it doesn't end there. That is because there is a feature I don't think a lot of people actually talk about but that is these pet wearables and the fact that in world 10 you can actually purchase or not world 10 get a little ahead of myself world 9 you can purchase the demon crown for 50,000 tickets and it gives you a 75 percent boost now we do have some wearables but i'm going to go ahead and take them all off just to make sure we can reapply them to the right team and then of course put the demon crowns on first but there is a world in which i would be willing to sit down and actually grind out purchasing a bunch of demon crowns so my problem is i'd have to transfer the token to my alt accounts, then my alt accounts AFK. Because they limit it to basically one demon crown purchase every, I think it's 30 minutes or 20 minutes. Uh, it, it's just a little slow. It's really tedious. And so it's just not something that I think would be super worth it. But we can go ahead and do a little math here in a second because we're, because we should be able to apply all of our pet wearables. Yeah, we do have, as you can see, where we don't have all of the pet wearable slots unlocked, but 35 pet wearables probably average out to around a 40% boost on most of the team, but it's not on all the team. So I'll say that gives us around like another... 30% boost, being a little conservative, 236 billion stats, which is pretty impressive because I think for the Bunny Dominus, we had around just over like 300 billion stats. So considering this is free to play, because again, I did get this for free. I just opened Lucky Blocks, got it from the leaderboard. Okay, well, just kidding. The pet wearables, you have to spend Robux to get more pet, pet wearable equipped. So that's not really free to play, but it's still 181 billion stats. That is absurd. So let's go and actually see. Equip the bicep. We don't have on any of the 3X boost. We don't have any friends boost and we just have a little bit of strength boost. But using those numbers, we should be able to calculate. So we have four, oh my gosh, 411 QI. So 411 times three for using the triple boost and then times by 1.5 for staying in the server for 150 minutes and then times 1.2. Oh no, I'm actually doing this all wrong. It's 120%. Hold up, so 411 times three times 2.5, sorry. And then times 2.2, 120%. Wait, you're telling me if I got all of the max boost, the 
the triple, the strength boost for time, and the friends boost. We would be getting, what is that? 6.7 SX per curl? There's no way. Okay, now listen, I'm not gonna be experiencing that with now because I have a feeling I'm going to need to save these codes for the new world 10 in about a week, or I guess by the time this is going up in a few days. So you will get to see me in action, probably using one of the strongest strength teams in the literal entire game of Arm Wrestling Simulator. Just a few days. So if you haven't already subscribed, make sure to be subscribed. And again, I really hope, I mean, there is a small chance, or I guess there's actually a pretty good chance that this Elite Cobalt, since the base value of this pet might get heavily reduced and nerfed from the developers that this is no longer my best pet. So I'm really hoping that doesn't happen because again, now that you can see there's 156 that exists. So there's even more that exists now than when we just started recording about an hour ago. And so this illegal and banned pet, I, I really hope we still get to take advantage of it because we did earn it fair and square. I understand it was a glitch. I understand it was a mishap. And if I do end up losing this pet, then that is fine. But again, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you haven't already dropped the sub, make sure to drop a sub, comment your Roblox name down below. If you want a chance at winning these other elite cobalts that we have on the account. And with all being said, it's been a boy Quack. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Deuces!